Hi, my name is Halima Azhar and welcome to Rethinking Reality with Halima. Today in Rethinking Reality, we will talk about corporal punishment in Pakistan. After Abdullah, only a 16 year old child tried to commit suicide due to intense punishment in school has initiated discussion about culture of violence and corporal punishment in our schools. Corporal punishment or physical punishment is intended to cause pain to a person. Kicking, pulling, arm twisting, using cane on a student or making them stand in uncomfortable positions are all kinds of corporal punishments. Due to the severe implications of corporal punishment, it was banned in Pakistan in the year 2014. And unfortunately, we still have acceptance for corporal punishment in Pakistan. Surprisingly, it is not only teachers who accept corporal punishment, but also students and their parents. These teachers and students are unaware of the implications of corporal punishment. Despite ban, there is acceptance for corporal punishment among teachers, parents, and students as well. When first graders were asked what should be done to a student who does not follow instructions properly, their response was shocking. Let's have a look at it. कौन कौन कहते प्यार से समझाना चाहिए और कौन कौन कहते कि मारना चाहिए? Unfortunately, parents and teachers are unaware of the consequences of corporal punishment. It affects our children mentally, physically, and emotionally. Most importantly, it starts the vicious cycle of violence begets violence. Senior students hit juniors when teachers hit them. And juniors, they hit plants, animals, or anything they can show their aggression on. Other than this, they also fight among each other. Corporal punishment in schools desynthesizes students. The classroom environment, teacher actions, and even curriculum does not teach them otherwise. Not only this, teachers who have practiced corporal punishment for years are not given alternative methods of teaching or classroom management trainings. So the question arises, if students are unaware about their rights regarding corporal punishment and teachers are not given training on the subject, then making it illegal is the solution to the problem or mere space saving in front of international community. Thank you for watching. Share with us the problems that you see in our educational system. Next time, we will be talking about single nation curriculum and religious intolerance in Pakistan.